I'm here today with Carol at Waterman's Farm, and she's going to tell us a little bit about her corn maze. So Carol, can you tell us a little about your farm? Yes. <laughs> we have been in business since 1978. We are here located on the southeast side of Indianapolis. I like to say that there's still country in this city, and that this farm is here not just for us, but for everyone in the city to come visit and enjoy. We started out thinking we would be a pick-your-own farm, and we do still do pick-your-own, but we find that we're selling more and more product that's already picked. People seem to have more, not enough time mm -hmm. to spend that way, so they come and get the products that are already picked. In October, we have a festival of the full month where we offer pumpkins and hay rides to the pumpkin patch where you can choose from acres of pumpkins. You can have fun picking your pumpkin, you can take a pony ride while you're here. You can watch our dinosaur chomp on pumpkins and growl <laughs> and see the chunks fall to the ground. You can uh, ride on the pedal cars. You can bounce in the bouncies and slide on the slides. You can is there? Oh, go through our, the maze in our cornfield, mazes in our cornfield. There's a straw bale maze that's dark and has dead ends. It's designed to crawl through. There's a big pile of straw that you just climb on and have fun. You have to create your own game here. We don't have rules established mm -hmm. for it. You get on the, <laughs> on the straw pile and decide what you want to do, which is usually bounce and crawl and mm -hmm. climb and have fun. And if someone come at, can't make it out to this location, you actually have another location with different fall activities as well. Can you tell us a little about, about that? Yes, on Highway 37, a mile, whoops, no, a half mile south of the Mary and Johnson County line. We have a farm where we raise pumpkins and sweet corn. And in October, our daughter, Lisa, fixes the market up to offer some more quiet activities, some more low-key activities related to art and storytelling and quiet fun like that. She, uh, you can make a scarecrow there and take it home with you. Actually, you can do that at this location too, I forgot that. <laughs> um, you can make uh, a mosaic out of Indian corn. You can put on a puppet show. She has small scarecrows that you can use as puppets and she has a theater set up where you can sit on straw bales for, to view the show and make up your own show and do it. There's a place where you can cuddle up with a book in the reading nook. There's a, instead of a sand pile, she has kernels of corn in a sand pile box and the kids love to play with that. So well, that sounds like a lot of fun. And is. if somebody wants to check out um, your music schedule or your hours, where can they go to do that? www.watermansfarmmarket.com. All right, perfect. Thanks, Carol. Thank you.